Just a quick one today, guys. Um, so I've been purchasing the one uh, Punch Man uh, manga. Sorry for the weird glare. This is number 19. That's the back. That's Fubuki. Great picture of Fubuki. Um, so I want to protect these. Now, they do sell uh, manga plastic polypropylene bags, but I've yet to see any for sale around in this country. And I'm in Canada. Last I saw them there in France. So I, I just take my Silver Age polypropylene, nothing fancy. Insert the uh, Tecomon or the manga volume into the plastic. All fingers here today. Very simple. Now you notice, like, there's a lot of excess, of course, right? Because, but the great thing about Silver Age bags is that they will fit any size. So then I just kind of take it like this. So I keep the uh, title spine nice and tight, and then I fold it over, take a piece of uh, scotch tape, as such, and basically just tape the side. Kind of like your wrapping presents, right? So. Got one side, now I've got to do something about this. Literally just fold it over, nothing fancy. Bring it down on the top, take another piece of tape, and tape the top. Like so. So if you want to be really fancy, I mean I can use a couple more pieces of tape and try and get a pretty good seal around there. But, you know, the important thing is that you've now preserved your manga in plastic. Keep the air away from it, the moisture away from it, and whatnot. And my God, that's a good picture, Fubuki. Uh, yeah, very simple, very cheap. Uh, just will keep the pages white. Looks great. So, there you go. How to uh, use comic bags to preserve your manga. All right. Thanks. Talk to everybody again.